what's up you guys welcome back to another day of vlogmas i am just now leaving work and it is super dark outside and it's only six o'clock but you guys know that's what happens once the time changes but anyway we are back for another day of vlogmas and i wanted to go to the store with you guys so we could see what's available as great christmas gift ideas when I go to TJ Maxx, I usually find really creative gifts at a very affordable price. So I wanted to take you guys with me. And instead of doing this like a sit down video, I wanted to do it more like vlog style. So without any further ado, let's go to TJ Maxx and see what we can find. My number one gift idea for women is always going to be bags. You know why? Because you don't need to know what size they wear. TJ Maxx has a whole bunch of options. I really like these two and the pretty colors that they came in. But they also have a whole bunch of these Dune bags. They range from $29.99 to $34.99 and they come in so many beautiful colors. So I think this would be a perfect gift for the stylish women in your life. The travel lover in your life would totally be appreciative of a new set of luggages, but these, they were a little up there in price, but just in general, even if you don't get them from TJ Maxx, getting a set of luggage for someone who travels a lot is definitely a great gift idea. If you see a mirror, that's a sign to check the outfit. <laughs> I'm wearing Zara pants, she and sweater, nasty gal coat, nine west booties, Tory Burch bag. Now, another gift idea that we love is jewelry. Again, you don't need to know their sizes, right? So there's a variety of jewelry. They have like the fine jewelry that's locked away, so you can inquire about that. Or you could just look on the floor for the variety of jewelry that they have. Look at these earrings for $12.99. They are pretty affordable and the options are endless. So whether it is for little girls or for adult women in your life, jewelry is always the way to go. Another great gift idea that does not require you to know someone's size are scarves. And I love that a lot of these come with a matching hat. So if you're looking for a gift idea for a coworker, I know a lot of different offices have secret centers. This would be definitely a great gift to give someone that you don't know their size. I wouldn't have thought of this, but hair tools, that could totally be a great gift idea. TJ Maxx had a variety of options and they also had a lot of hair accessories. I'm thinking that these would make really great stocking stuffers. So if you're looking for small items, that's something to consider. Between lashes, lipstick, chapstick, eyeshadow palettes, and even makeup sponges, there are endless ideas of things makeup related that you could put together to create like a nice gift basket for someone. So that's definitely a great idea and I think it would be very affordable if you went that route. I also picked up some of those Real Technique sponges for myself. Shop for yourself while you at it, girl. Beauty gurus rave about jade rollers and being in these pretty packages, they'll definitely make a cute gift for someone who's into skincare. Although I have not tried this, I am assuming that an ice roller would be the perfect addition to your pamper day routine. I love that TJ Maxx has so many sample sizes of different makeup brands. So for someone who's into skincare and makeup, you can find different gift sets that are already packaged well so that's definitely something to consider i really like this carousel that has makeup brushes and sponges that will definitely make a perfect gift that you can just throw inside a gift bag and you're ready to go Perfumes and colognes could be a hit or miss as some people are sensitive to certain scents. I personally really like to receive them, but I guess you'd have to tread lightly depending on who you're gifting them to. There were quite a few boots and booties available at TJ Maxx. I actually found a pair similar to the one that I featured in my recent boot collection. If you didn't see that video, I'll be sure to link it here. At $34.99, this would be a great gift for the stylish girl in your life. I really like this color option as well. I always recommend neutral shoes, so it definitely helps to have a pair of booties like this. And the price is right. 
This Moscow Mule set would be a perfect housewarming gift or you could gift it to someone who recently moved in or is just into making drinks and hosting. I love that it comes with its own stand and the cups are really just so beautiful. My mom is one of those people that we always gift kitchen items to. So maybe we might not do that this year because at one point she ended up with eight blenders. Okay, <laughs> we absolutely need to put an end to that. But look at this pan. It absolutely stopped me in my tracks. I love the gold accent with the handles. So this would be a great gift for someone who likes cooking. If you were to give someone Christmas themed items, they definitely wouldn't be able to use them until the following year. So I guess this is more for if you're buying things for yourself, for your house. TJ Maxx definitely has a lot of decorative pieces and Christmas plates and mugs and cups. So you can consider that for yourself. As soon as I saw these wooden bowls and things, I just was thinking about my mom and how she would love these. And then I remember, I just told myself, we're not buying her any more kitchen items, okay? <laughs> but these would make great gifts. These seem so unorganized, but I'm sure that's with people shuffling through them trying to find the best designs. But in general, planners and journals definitely will make great stocking stuffers or just things to buy for yourself. So consider those. Since the pandemic started, everyone tapped into their personal interior designer because the more time we spent at home, the more we wanted it to feel like a sanctuary. So I can't think of anyone that wouldn't like some extra pillows, some organizational baskets, frames to add on their walls, and all kinds of like decorative things. I really like this blue basket. I'm considering that one. It's so pretty. They also have a whole lot of vases and things, so that helps for all the plant lovers. And I really like this little thing. I don't know what it was, but I think it would be great to hold your jewelry. Candles are just a no-brainer when it comes to gift giving. I mean, you can never go wrong. There are so many options at TJ Maxx and on the internet. So definitely consider candles, room sprays, diffusers, all of those smell good things, no one's ever gonna say no to that. Personalized gifts are always the best. Using a frame, you can totally print out a picture of a special moment from this year and gift it to your loved ones. I have never worn one of these ugly sweaters, but if that's your cup of tea, child, <laughs> go right ahead. <laughs> Are these considered ugly socks or are they just Christmas socks? <laughs> Whatever they are, you can get them at TJ Maxx. I've shared quite a few ideas for the ladies in your life, but the guys, they need some love too. I really like this dresser valet. It holds your phone, your wallet, keys, and everything. When you get home, you can just drop everything in one place. The watch case that holds five watches right above it was also a great idea. Again, same thing for colognes and perfume, tread lightly because you don't know what scents people are sensitive to. I love the idea of gifting whiskey stones, but to put it in a box with socks just doesn't seem right to me, but <laughs> it's probably still a good idea. For the gamers in your life, they could use new gaming systems and they could use headphones to go along with those. There are also mugs and cups with the logos of different sports teams or even TV shows, so that's something that could work. Know someone who loves hosting game night? There are definitely a whole bunch of games available out there. There are also a whole bunch of puzzles that you can consider. This section had some really great options. They had party speakers and they also had turntables. This option was even nicer because it had a record crate to go with the turntables. I also like the karaoke mic, but that's probably a little childish, but hey, we all have a child in us. <laughs> I also like the idea of a mini cooler that is really portable and you could just have it in your room or on the go with you. That's a cool idea. Which reminds me, there's also a mini fridge that they have that looks just like that for skincare. So consider that. I love the idea of a projector for your phone. That's really cool. 
and if you have any YouTubers in your life, a ring light is definitely helpful. And considering the amount of Zoom meetings that we have nowadays, anybody can find that useful. Designer sweaters and shirts that are already packaged are definitely a great idea. These were at decent prices and some of them were cashmere and more expensive, obviously. And also coats are a good idea if you live somewhere cold. For the active people in your life, definitely consider new workout sets. I love the ones with pockets in them. I stopped to try on this faux leather top. It was from French Connection, I believe. I really liked it. Not sure why I didn't get it, but I was trying to stay focused on the assignment at hand. <laughs> but it was a really, really nice shirt. I love the color. I think Zara has something similar, but that's not why we're here today. <laughs> Last but not least, we have something for the coffee and tea lovers. These mugs are so pretty. And right next to them, they had a whole variety of different coffee flavors, pumpkin spice, caramel. All of the Starbucks lovers would love that. I have finally left TJ Maxx. I was in there for like an hour and a half. To reward myself, I got some of these. These are um, white cheddar puffs. I always love getting the snacks over there. They're usually the big size bags and they're $2.99. I also got the veggie barbecue chips and I can't wait to try these, but you know, it's still COVID outside. So I got to sanitize my hands and all of that stuff. So I'll probably wait till I get home. But otherwise, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. There were some good stuff in there. I feel like usually it's really busy around this time in the store, but thankfully today it wasn't that bad. So it was easy to film without having too many people around. But all in all, I think the earlier you start going in stores to get your stuff, and even if you're ordering online, it really will make a difference. So I recommend starting early so that you don't have to worry about shipping delays or overcrowded stores. So I hope that you found these ideas helpful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow for another video. Bye guys. Thank you.